Hi everybody, it's Lisa here at Vent Haven for the latest video. As you can see, I am um, absolutely alone and doing my social distancing, so this video will not be of the quality that you're used to, but I hope you can forgive us for that. Uh, the first thing I have to do to get ready to clean is to bring out all of my supplies. So that's everything from uh, Windex to vacuum cleaners, large and small, and a notebook to take notes about what I move and change. Uh, the museum is actually, in my mind, divided into seven regions, and the first one that I clean is the back uh, section of the original garage building, which is where the new for 2020 exhibit will go. Okay, so I've moved out uh, the class of 2019, and I've also taken out the Leonardo section there. And so now I will get my stepladder and get up on it to clean the photographs on this corner. One of the reasons for cleaning every photo is that I might come across something like this. That is a tiny little bug who would love to make his life in there chewing up a photo. When Mr. Berger was alive, he didn't have any pest control, and so many of his photos got chewed up around the edges by silverfish. Uh, today, luckily, we have great pest control, and this is infrequent but I still have to look for it. So I'm about to get this guy out. After um, I clean the corner there where the Leonardo figures sit, I take each one and I clean it individually. Uh, this is Poncho. I take the heads out and I look for uh, just any kind of you know dirt or dust and wipe that off. I can brush his hair and uh, I, you know, I'll check for any new damage or anything like that. He's looking pretty good. And then with regard to the bodies, I brush, I use a fabric brush and go through the outfit a little bit at a time and brush off any dust that might have accumulated over the fall. I also can wipe his little face with a damp cloth and his hands as well. Then I clean his card and set him back up. So now each of the Leonardo set has been cleaned and they are back in place. And time to move to the L.L. Brooks set. And now the L.L. Brooks set is clean and ready and all of this up front is ready for the class of 2020. And here they are, the class of 2020. All spiffed up and ready for tourists. The next thing I'm gonna clean is the bleachers. The bleachers are about a hundred dummies and each one needs to be cleaned. Uh, typically it takes me about uh, three hours to clean these guys, but I got a feeling that I can do half of these in about a minute. Ready, set, go. No big deal. All right, I gotta get back to it and get some more cleaning done. But I hope you enjoyed this sneak peek video about what it's like to get ready for tourism here at Vent Haven. I hope you're doing well and I hope to see you soon here at the museum. Thanks so much for watching.